So what is NYC School of Data? How many of you read the website? This is the question. All right. Who can really eloquently say what is NYC School of Data? M me. All right. Um, NYC School of Data is a collaborative network improving New York City's data ecosystem. This network seeks to enrich our lives and communities through technology, data, and design. And this year, we've invited the civic hackers and community-based organizations to learn from each other and learn how we can improve our communities and our data. This is a term of art. It was, uh, we've seen it uh, in Chicago. We've seen it in Europe. We are now bringing it here to New York City to hopefully uh, surround and hug and love our anniversary of the city's open data law. So um, please, if you want to blog about what you feel is New York City School of Data, Give us an interpretation. We want to know what your New York City School of Data. We want it to be a long, uh, lasting conversation of how do we use New York City's open data to improve all of our lives. These things are framed off of what our community has defined as uh, the four freedoms of the 21st century, which are the freedom to connect, the freedom to learn, the freedom to innovate, and the freedom to collaborate. We see these as our base values, our community values that we uh, surround ourselves to build a more prosperous and harmony, uh, ha harmonious 21st century. Um, I know that it may seem a little kumbaya, but these are the values that we have expressed from Beta NYC, and we hope to share with you today. So if you're looking for the schedule, we have it here at schoolofdata.nyc forward slash schedule. Um, once again, if you open up the little booklet, you'll have the highlights of the different sessions. And at this particular link, you'll actually find the session descriptions. This will take you to a Google Doc, so don't be scared that it's taking you off the site. Uh, but this is our way of embracing the cloud and making sure that our website doesn't go down in the middle of a conference. Uh, that uh, being said, I want to thank all of our sponsors. So thank you, Manhattan Borough President Gail Brewer, Microsoft Civic, the Fund for the City of New York, Data and Society, Acela, CardoDB, Civic Hall, and the Internet Society. Can we give them a round of applause for sponsoring this beautiful event? And uh, this day wouldn't be possible without our volunteers. Um, I want to thank our uh, organizing committee, Lauren, the de esteemed designer of our graphics, logo, and maps and manuals for the day. Uh, Farheen, who is running around with a plastic uh, uh, check-in list. Uh, Dirk, Ken, and Lucio uh, for volunteering their time uh, and really figuring out what we're gonna be doing today. Um, then I would like to thank our NYC code uh, for America fellows that are in town, Amo, Amulia, Charlie, and Keith, who have uh, jumped into managing and vol uh, managing our 30 plus volunteers. And lastly, I want to thank our volunteers where uh, if it wasn't for them, we wouldn't be able to operate today. We have 35 people who have uh, option to give labor over capital to ensure that this day is a beautiful day. And I wanna thank all of these volunteers who are here helping us make sure that we have a successful day. I also wanna thank the Data and Society support staff and the Civic Hall staff for making sure that we had all of our I's dotted and our T's crossed. And lastly, I wanna thank Sitter Studio for being such a great partner in providing childcare for the day and bringing in an extra sitter to ensure that those of you who are parents or who are overseeing uh, young ones for the day can have an opportunity to attend. Uh, this is something that uh, as I've aged in this community, uh, I'm starting to become very uh, cautious, uh, conscientious about that we need to be providing uh, better spaces for parents and those who are taking care of others. And so if you're an organizer and you need any help in figuring out how to offer childcare, I'm more than happy to provide some advice and we have some great uh, allies who have gone through this process beforehand. So um, yes, we have childcare. Uh, if you need childcare at your event, I would love to talk to you about it. And I just wanna say thank you uh, for all of these partners for uh, going above and beyond uh, what we originally thought out that we were planning. Um, 
So we're here to talk about information. Uh, how many of you know the history of New York City's open data law? Just a few of you, which is great. You're at a school to learn all about it. Believe it or not, if you went to uh, find New York City uh, data in 1992, you uh, would have had to open up this particular book and flipped through pages till you found your agency, and then you would have been able to find what was the application, uh, what was the year that the application was started, and what was in that database. This was the city's open data program in the early 1990s. We're very, very fortunate to have leadership in New York City who fought for turning legislation that would then turn this dictionary into uh, the signing of the city's open data law on the 7th of March in 2012, which we feel here at Beta NYC has created uh, is a turning point in our understanding of how technology and data can be used to improve all of our lives. And so while many people who were um, in New York probably felt like Wharf as like WTF, why are you guys celebrating transparency around open data? There were some of us that were absolutely ecstatic that we had a government that we argued and collaborated with and then argued and then collaborated with and then argued and then finally coalesced into getting the city's open data law passed. It was a multi-year fight. It was a, a fight that took good government groups, uh, community-based organizations, and government collaborating together to get this monumental law passed. Uh, and we, today, we're going to hear some, from some keynote speakers who are essentially taking us uh, into the 21st century and figuring out ways how we are using these three things of technology, data, and design to improve our city. So with that, uh, welcome to NYC School of Data. For those of you who are needing some chairs in the back, uh, for those of you who have empty seats, this is the drill. Come find these hands if you want to come sit down. All right, if not, you can stay back there, but they're around, they're right up here in the front. Um, so with that being said, I'm gonna invite John Caney up for a very quick lightning talk, and we'll kick off with our morning keynotes. So thank you very much. There's some more room in front if folks wanna keep filtering up here. Please do, please do. So let's give Noel a huge round of applause here. He did this himself. If you're